I have finding the sum and product of um, quadratic equations. Um, for my first example, we'll have 2x squared plus 3x minus 4 equals 0. From here, I can conclude that a equals 2, b equals 3, and c equals negative. Now there, for, there's a different equation for both sum and product. For sum, it is root 1 plus root 2 equals negative b over a. Um, from here, I can take a and b and plug them into the formula. Negative 3 over 2, which is um, the sum of the roots. And for the product, The equation is root 1 times root 2 equals c over a. Now, c is negative 4 and a is 2, so I'd have negative 4 over 2, which can be reduced down to negative 2. And these are the answers for this specific equation. Now, from here you can do it backwards as well. You can start with the, um, the sum of the roots and make the actual equation. Say you start with uh, ten, the sum, 10 equals um, negative b over 1. Now I'd have to set b equal to uh, 10, which means I'd have to multiply each side by negative 1. And then uh, I get b equals 10. Now I can get the uh, um, product as well. For this specific one, it's 9 equals c over 1, which uh, just can, can be reduced down to c equals 9. Now, since um, the a is 1 in both of these equations, um, um, we can just write that a equals 1. And from here, since a is the first part of the qu quadratic equation, b is the second, and uh, c is the last, I can go in that order, making it x squared plus 10x equals, uh, I mean, plus nx plus 9 equals 0, which is the final answer for that.